Hey, while you in the first five seconds of the video, go ahead, like and subscribe. Shalom Israel, this is Bishop Nathaniel. I want you to know that you can view all our Sabbath classes live on IUIC TV. That's right, I said on IUIC TV. Download the app today. Shalom. God's holy day. Let's get to the point. When's God holy day? You said when? Seventh day. The seventh day. What day is that? You said Sunday. You got a phone on you? No. You I got a phone. Yeah, she got a phone on her. Pull out your calendar, Minnie. What about you, June, bud? Because she said the Lord Holy Day is the seventh day, which it is. What? What's the seventh day, though? You know, they say, they say, you know, the seventh day, then they say seven. So, but when, they, when I hear seven, I feel like that's a Saturday. But, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And the same, you know, the world, how the world set up, you know. So, so hold on, pull up, so you got an iPhone, pull up your calendar real quick. So we got your calendar up, right? So you said when you hear Sabbath, you think of Saturday. Hey, uh, Soldier Obadiah, Saturday, uh, Sabbath in Spanish is Sabado, right? Sabado. Sabado means Saturday. That sounds close to Sabbath, right? So you are right. The Sabbath is Saturday. It is Saturday. It's not Sunday, but and on your calendar, the first day of the week, is Sunday. Our people, that's another thing. We not keeping the Sabbath. That's what we finna go into and see what the Bible is teaching, teaching y'all how to love God. To love God is to keep his commandments. Remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. So God is saying, remember the Sabbath day. Remember the Sabbath day. It's only one reason why I would tell somebody to remember something. Why is that? Because you bound to forget, right? And look at our people today. We forgot. We think the Sabbath day is on Sunday. God knows his people. You got kids, June, but your kids forget a lot of stuff, don't they? My kids forget everything unless they want something. Unless they, and guess how black people act towards God? We for, hey, we forget God commandments. Hey, I know some, I knew people that used to, when I was in the world, I knew used to, I know people that used to pray before they went to go hit a lick. I'm dead serious. What kind of nonsense is that? So he said, remember the Sabbath day, read. To keep it holy. To keep it holy. You know, uh, that's the fourth commandment. One of the Ten Commandments. Many, stay, stay, stay. Stay. Because I'm teaching you how to love God. Because before, you didn't know how. Remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. Six days thou shalt labor and do all thy work. So the Lord is telling you how to keep the Sabbath holy. Keep it separate. Keep it sacred. It's a sacred day. Yeah, it's a resting day. But like, but it. always feel like it anyway too. It's weird. Yeah, but why, but we go, we go see how we supposed to chill according to God on the Sabbath. Cause you're right. It is a resting day, but we gonna see how we supposed to rest. Read. But the seventh day is the seventh of the Lord thy God. So the seventh day, Sabado, Saturday, is the Sabbath day of the Lord. Read. Six days shalt thou labor and do all thy work. So the God, so God gave you six days, June Bug, to do all your work. From Sunday, which starts Saturday evening, so Sunday all the way until Friday. Before Friday evening, you got every opportunity to uh, make your money legally. Uh, take care of your doctor's appointments. Maybe you got to hire somebody for some yard work, do whatever. You got six days for that. You got six days to do that from Sunday to Friday. But guess what? Read. But the seventh day. But the seventh day, which is what day, June, bud? Sunday. No. I mean. Seven. Seven. Uh, seven. You said seven or something. Like the seven. seventh day. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Saturday, exactly. So the seventh day is what day? Which on our calendar would be considered what day? 
No. Oh, don't count. Pull up. You got your phone. Yeah, but hold on. I'm saying like, no, no. We got it. We got to do this. Come on, come on, come on. On the calendar, the calendar will be Sunday. No, no, absolutely not. Pull out your. I need you to pull out your phone now. Because even in modern day, on our calendars, the seventh day is Saturday. Come for it, sis. What we learning about? What's your name? What's your name, sis. Tiffany, what we learning about today, Tiffany, is what God, what's God's holy day? What's the holy day for God? What do you think? What What do you think uh, God consider as a holy day? What day of the week? <laughs> you know, if, it's fine if you don't know. It's fine. Because what we out here doing is teaching our people in the Bible what his holy day is. Because a lot of our people think it's Sunday. You see a lot of people. But, yes, it is Saturday. And we're going to see. So, Junebug, you got your calendar up? I'm getting it right now. Because even on your calendar. You know what I'm saying? Look, in the, in, the, in the world, it's Sunday. But I'm talking about as in, in, in the Bible, it's Saturday. See what I'm saying? Right. That's what I'm saying. But even in the world, we make it even worse, though, Junebug. What I'm trying to show you, no, you said even in the world, the first day is Sunday. The calendar start with Sunday. So what's your, what's your question, sir? All right. So hold on. Read it again. Verse 10. But the seventh day, so but sa Saturday, read, is the Sabbath of the Lord thy God. It's the Lord's holy day. Saturday is the Lord's holy day. Read. In it thou shalt not do any work. So you shouldn't be working on Saturday. That's how you keep it holy. That is one of the Ten Commandments. Our people like to say, oh, I keep the Ten Commandments. Uh, thou shalt not. Uh, kill, commit adultery. But when it comes to remember the Sabbath day to keep the Lord holy, uh, God, he don't care about that. But that's one of the Ten Commandments. And we're not supposed to work. Not us. Read. Thou nor thy son, nor our kids. Read. Nor thy daughter, nor your daughter, nor thy main servant, nor the people working for you. So you shouldn't have anybody doing servile work right. for you, right. neither you, on the Sabbath. That's right. And it's, it's a seven. It's a seven on the calendar. Right. Exactly. Exact the moon, though. Another thing. Tuesday went. Right. Exactly. You get. You get what I'm. You got me right. You got me right. So let's continue to give me one sec. Let's continue to get in. Uh, get into how we rest. Or like we like to say, chill on the Sabbath. Give me Nehemiah chapter 10 and 31. Because I mentioned also part of chilling on the Sabbath is not buying or selling. Right. You can't buy or sell. What about the wife? You can't buy or sell. That's for everybody. We're going to prove it out the Bible. Read. This is the book of Nehemiah chapter 10 verse 31. And if the people of the land bring where or any visuals on the Sabbath day to sell, that we would not buy it by them on the Sabbath. Read that again. And if the people of the land... So, if the people of the land... So, the people of the land... So, no matter where you're at, we in Chicago right now, we on Chicago and Hamlin, you see stores everywhere. Got the corner store, gas station, food place, whole nine. Read. Bring... Where are any visuals on the Sabbath day to sell? So if they bring any merchandise, whether it be food, clothing, uh, anything, anything that you can use and consume, anything, if they bring it to sell, read. That we would not buy it by them on the Sabbath. So wait, that we wouldn't buy it on the Sabbath. So we're not supposed to be buying on the Sabbath. That's right. So if we can't buy, we ain't supposed to be selling either. Right. Read. On, or on the holy day. And that we would leave the seventh year and the extraction of the every debt. So I just wanted to get it show that we're not supposed to buy or sell on the Sabbath. That's, right. That's how we rest on the Sabbath. That's so, Speaker, how we you are right. We are teaching... I, w I want to correct you on one thing. We're not teaching Christianity. Right, Christianity right. is right. this yeah, right, right here. Saying, you don't teach Christianity. We are, teaching, we are right. teaching our history. We are teaching God's law, okay. statutes, and commandments. We are Israelites. Yep, we are the Israelites. You understand, ma'am? What's your name? I'm sorry. 
Karen. Karen, we are teaching that we, the blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans, are the Israelites. We are God's chosen people. God chose us to be special people. We, God loves us, but we are not loving God properly. We used to scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are how we're men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.